What is the most powerful word in the history of the world? You say Jesus. Well, that's the most powerful name. But what's the most powerful word? A word that uh, freedom-loving people have as a normal part of their vocabulary. You say, what would that be? The word no. I was thinking about that today and I thought, you know, there's a lot of things that we just need to say no to. The Bible says that the fear of man bringeth a snare, but whoso trusteth in the Lord shall be safe. Um, we're not supposed to fear man. We're not supposed to fear what man can do to us. And uh, there's a lot of things that are coming out right now that we're being told we need to accept and we need to be okay with. Um, I need to be okay with some woman that doesn't think that she's a woman anymore. She thinks that she's a, a binary or something. No, I'm not okay with that. You need to call me something. You need to, don't use personal pronouns. No, I'm not okay with that. Um, some guy wants to look like a woman, puts a dress on and whatever else. I'm going to go into the bathroom. I saw some little girl go in there and I have just as much right to go in as she does. No, you don't. No, 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 you don't. Um, you need, need to, you know, to come into the store here. Uh, no, no. Need to take the hokey pokey and turn yourself around. No, no. Um, whatever it is, you need to give up your uh, ability to protect yourself with a firearm. No. Simple. No. <laughs> um, you need to give up your King James Bible. No. You need to come to church. Mm, no, I don't. It's not in the Bible. Uh, you need to give me 10% of your tithe money. Uh, no, no, that's not in the Bible either. Uh, nobody in the New Testament gave a 10% tithe to the pastor uh, so that he could keep the uh, mortgage payments on the church building going. Um, go down through the list. If you love freedom, you'll learn to say no. Uh, hey, you know what? Why don't you come over here and get drunk? No. It's all right. No, thank you. You can drink if you want to, whatever else, but uh, for me, no. Um, why don't you come here on the street corner and we'll give you some nice drugs that, that can help you to really get on a neat trip or whatever. No. No. Just say no. Like the old campaign used to say. Just say no. That's what free people do. And, uh, Going forward, I want you to remember that. If you're out there and you love freedom, the only word you really need to know is no. <laughs> All right? Just a quick little video there just to encourage you. Learn to say no. Your friends say, hey, come with us. We want you to go to this place here. No. No. You're a young saved lady. Some guy comes up to you and some uh, perverted guy and whatever else. And hey, baby, and why don't you come out with me? No. No. And that's really all you need to say, by the way, too, with a lot of this stuff. You don't have to get into some big kind of yelling match and argument and whatever else. No. No. Went into a store uh, during the last two years, if you know what I mean. And uh, they told me I had to have a special thing on my face. And I said, uh, no. And I just walked on. <laughs> I didn't go into statistics or facts and figures and whatever else. I just said, no. No. And um, that's what free people do. Say no. That's going to be it. Please say no to things that you know are wrong.